Hello everyone, this is Alien Square, and today I will present to you a new um, betting strategy uh, on football games. This is called Double Win, and it's, it is about uh, picking a team and betting that the team will um, win the next game, and in case it will win, you'll have a profit. Uh, so, on the left side, this is the presentation. And on the right side, um, I've created a tool that will help you to to bet using this strategy. So moving, what you'll have to do is to choose a team and bet on that team that it will win the next game. Uh, if it loses, you'll have to bet again and bet again until it will eventually win. So this is how it works. Um, to to give um, one example is uh, I put here the um, games for Espanol all games uh, they had this season so you can see that uh, this is the home team and the away team and also the dates when they played and uh, this this is the the result so in, in the first example it was a six four for Sevilla. Uh, in the last two columns, uh, these are the odds which the bookmaker bet 365 put for the home team here and for the away team here. So I will show to you how to uh, use this file with the strategy. So what you have to do is to fill in the division, which is uh, Spanish uh, first league and then put the name of the team and um, select a profit that you want to make with uh, this team so I will say um, 5 euros should be okay then you need to fill in the yellow columns where is yellow here and also this one so let me start with the first uh, game uh, Espanol you need to look at the odds they had to win so we're play we're putting always Espanol that will win the next game so here they had five the odds so I will put a five here and I will need to um, pick the first bet so let's let's say two euros so this is also the investment um, and here there is the profit in case I will win or lose so in 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 this case they lost the first game against Sevilla so I'll put a loss here so zero profit moving to the second game Espanol versus Malaga where they had a draw the ads where 2.3 so I have to put that 3.3 and here you always need to put an N I will show you in a bit what it what uh, this is used for and I will have to put a draw so what happens is that um, on the second game the this this tool it calculates how much you should bet which is here considering the ads that you get from the bookmaker in order to cover your previous investment of two euros plus this bet and to get you a five euro profit which is here so so in um, this this example it was a draw so you'll get zero profit but uh, uh, this is the uh, total investment that um, uh, you have with the two games so moving to the third one, Sociedad versus Espanol, it was a, also a draw. The odds were to uh, 3.75 and I will put an N. So you'll we'll have the total investment of um, almost 12 euros so far. Espanol versus Real Madrid 7.5 and they lost and I will put also an end here and then uh, Osasuna Espanol 
they they managed to to win this game which um with adds 2.6 so we'll have a win and then we'll put an end so you can see that in each of these games the file will um say to you how much you should bet in order to get the five euro profit and to cover the investment so with the last game you have to bet 12 euros with these ads to cover the investment of 26 euros so the profit it will be um 31 euros so this is a five euro profit you want to make if i will change that to 10 euros you can immediately notice that uh, here it gives you 10 euro profit but also the investment is bigger just because each time in case you'll win the bet it will have a uh, 10 euro profit so here if they would have one you will get 10 euros also this is also so it makes sense to have the investment bigger because you you need to cover the 10 euro profit each time and um, to 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 say for example that um, you want to cover three games so let's say i want to bet on espanol and get a 10 euro profit um, on the first three games but then if i don't win i want just to get the investment back because what what happens in in reality is that uh, you'll get uh, five or maybe more games to cover from the same team and it is more important to get your money back the investment and uh, um, disregard that small profit here so for us let's say after three games I get an investment of almost 20 euros and I, I will say uh, from from the next game I will just want to get this money back so what you have to do is to put on the last game on Y here so you can see that uh, the profit will be zero so this is um, putting the profit zero but uh, with this you can cover more games because the investment with each game it will be minimum so you'll have uh, instead of 45 euros here you'll have only 35 so you, you get to cover more games like this and uh, uh, therefore more chances to get the investment back but for this example I just put an N I want uh, the first five games to get me 10 euro profit so I will use this one here you can cover um, the expense for the next game so let's say here I'm not sure if I will win but I already know the odds for the next game after Osasuna it was with Celta 2.25 um, so just for your information to uh, to show to you how much you should bet on the next game in case this is not a win so they are playing right now but you have the odds for the next game and it says that um, so far if this will be lost you'll have a 44 year uh, 44 year investment and you'll have to bet a 35 euro to to cover all investment with a zero profit so this is just for you to check the next game not really mandatory but here i i won and uh, i got the 10 euro profit um the the good thing is that uh, with this tool you'll always bet the right amount so you you'll know with uh, the ads that uh, the bookmaker it will give to you you will have to bet only this amount to to cover the investment and to get a profit you don't need to uh, say i bet uh, 10 euro let's bet 20 next time because with this you will just run out of money and you will not have 
have enough to, to cover all these games so this is bringing the, the bet to the minimum but still it will make you the profit that you want to make and what's also good is that it cover your losses each time so you have the investment you know how much you spend on this team and uh, with the next bet which you manage to win it will uh, cover the the whole investment so you will just make a profit then um, one advice it will be on selecting the teams and um, I recommend not to bet on extreme favorites what that means is that um, taking for example Barcelona they have lower odds such a low for victory that it, it, it will not make sense to bet on to bet on them so let me show you the the file for Barcelona which I already filled in starting with this game from this season Barcelona versus Malaga they had 1.13 the odds which I put here then the next game 1.44 but they managed the draw also on the second game and with the third game against Real Madrid they had 1.85 and also a draw and they managed to, to win the fourth game so uh, as you can see what happens is that I will need to start with a um, higher bet so I put 15 euros to just make me a 2 euro profit in case I will win then I didn't win this time I will need to put almost 40 euros next time and then the next time almost 70 euros and on the fourth time 700 euros just to get the investment back and the 2 euro profit so as you can see the uh, in just 4 games the investment and the bet came to a 700 euros to to give you a two euro constant profit which uh, in my opinion it will not make sense to, to to choose this team also in case this would have been a loss then you'll have to bet next time on the 1.1 the odds just 4000 euro to get everything back so it, it it's very risky to, to, to pick up teams where they had uh, 1.1 or so the ads to to have the victory so I don't recommend this the good and bad with this strategy is that um, you don't need to mind the ads you don't need to um, to to say that the bookmaker is offering me to the, the ads this time too small so I will skip this game you don't need to do that you don't need to focus on how much you should bet with the next game because the file is already putting that for you and this way it will be 100 focus for you to pick the correct team so you need just to look for the team and don't mind anything else uh, what it also helps is that you can cover more games for the first team so let's say uh, I put a game this time but they didn't win and also the next time until they eventually will have a, a win and they will get anything back plus, plus this 10 euro profit so you don't lose anything uh, you can cover multiple teams at once which means that I can have a, a file for Espanol but I can also have some files for other teams and just bet on each time on each of these teams the bad thing is that um, you'll have probably one game per week so um, you'll put in the first week this bet but you'll lose and then on the second and third week and maybe just get anything back after a month so you need to be patient with this and in the end it will get you the 10 euro profit um, this is just one example for other teams they might win earlier than this after the first week or second week so it just uh, but for others you you might take up to two months to to get a win and the 
second bad thing is that you still will have to choose the team so you need to, to, to put the team correctly the team that it has more chances to to, to get a win in the next games and I, I have received this question on my other strategy how do you pick a team and um, I put some some bullet points here just because I don't have the absolute answer I don't know the absolute truth because otherwise I, I could just say to you that pick this team or that team but I don't know the full answer so I can maybe give you some directions uh, so that you can get the best team uh, picked. Uh, first you might look at statistics there are lots of statistics on the internet and for example how many goals per game they score uh, if a team will score only 1.5 goals but uh, another team will probably score 2.5 games uh, goals on average per game then you, you might have to choose the second team more goals it means that they have more chances to, to get a win if they play an offensive style and for example four defenders three midfielders and three attackers then they probably will have more chances to get a goal because they, they will get the ball forward uh, if they have good attackers um, good players then it is also a good thing that um, uh, probably will give them more chances to score if they are expected to qualify and for example the team is sitting somewhere in the uh, seventh or eighth place in the division in the first league and um, uh, nearing to to the end of the season they they want to push for a quali to, to qualify for the champions league then y you might expect them to win more games and also getting to know the team um, not saying specifics but uh, in case they have very good transfers they get uh, good players in or they change the coach or they have a very good strategy of playing recently uh, or a very good form then you might pick that team to, to use with this strategy so I hope that this, this will help uh, selecting the right team. Ready to start? Um, if you like this video, please share and subscribe. If you want the file, you can get it for free. Just email at aliensquare3 at gmail.com. Any other suggestions to improve the strategy are welcome. And if you want to, uh, to send them, just... Uh, uh, write an email or maybe comment on YouTube. Uh, I will reply, of course. Thanks for watching and see you next time. Bye.